What'd you do? Wow, great, thanks. Thanks for helping. When Jen is down to something, Suzy Q is always by her side. Mm, potatoes. When she comes to take a shower, Suzy is already there. Mm. She crawls all the way up and spreads her wings like an eagle. She always helps Jen with laundry Hi. and to pick the best outfit too. There is nothing else she loves more than sitting on her shoulder and getting scratches. Jen fills her trust with every cell of her body. But if you told her they'd get along like this, she wouldn't believe it. So Jen is a vet, she holds a little rescue flock of her own. But one day, she got a call from her client. He said that he rescued a parrot that was abused by the owners. And now he was looking for someone to adopt Suzy Q. Suzy Q, say hi to Jen. She'll never forget the first time she saw her. Jen couldn't believe her eyes. Former owners fed her with fast food, and she lost the half of her feathers. They left her alone for days, and she was so down that it broke Jen's heart. She knew she couldn't live without her, so she adopted Suzy Q. Oh, they had plenty of things to work on, and it wasn't always easy. At first, Suzy didn't let Jen close to her. She was so anxious that she would give her warning bites. I know, I know, sorry. But it didn't push Jen away. She knew Suzy is just protecting herself and one day the ice will break. She was given her food with vitamins and medication to grow her feathers back. Jen wanted her never to feel lonely again. You're the humans coming home soon. Yeah. And over time, she started noticing that Susie warmed up to her. She started climbing up on Jen's shoulder and asked for kisses, She would take treats from Jen's hands and even greet her with these cute sounds. You did it! Yeah! That's when she saw, well, this girl is not afraid anymore. I won her heart. Now Suzy Q can't share Jen with anyone or anything. Whether it's cleaning hey, no. <laughs> or her other parrot. Susie is just the sweetest girl she knows. And Jen can't imagine how much it took her to trust people again. But she's forever grateful that Susie Q chose her to open up to.